All right, guys, welcome again. Sorry about that. Just having a bit of technical difficulties with the internet and uh, Wi Fi connection. Um, so please just bear with us and be patient. Uh, we're going to wrap it up in the next uh, few minutes. I'm just sending her the invite. Carly Pitorius, I see you. Just give us a moment. Okay. Wenda. <laughs> Are we back? Sorry. <laughs> We're back. Yo, today the internet is not working with us at all. Not huh? playing along. It just goes to show that there's something that you, you're sharing today that is like vital information here uh, to save our youth athletes. Christy Bell, I see you. Sakile. Uh, S. Kruger. AJ Kruger. Uh, thanks for coming back on. Uh, Athletic for Amal, I see you guys, Kirsty. All right, so let's uh, just, uh, do you want to continue with the question or should I ask a new one? Uh, Jock Nell, big up to you. Thanks for keeping this champion. <laughs> um, I see, I, I can't remember now what you heard of my answer, but I see Athletic for Amal is asking now three or four times. <laughs> they really want to know what, <laughs> what lies. Beyond 2021 athletics for me, um, just to, yeah, I'm just quickly going to gonna, gonna um, respond to that, then we can continue. Okay. But yeah, at this stage, I'm, I'm just focusing on, on the Olympics. So yeah, I'm definitely aiming to, to qualify for that and, and go to Tokyo. Yeah. Um, after that, uh, I don't think I'm going to say too much. Um, Whatever the future brings, we will see. Um, in my mind, to be honest, um, I think I am moving towards uh, going to the end of my career after this, but you never know. <laughs> so it's, yeah, it's, let... it's, still, it's still an open book. <laughs> <laughs> we, don't have to, we don't have to say anything or commit to that yet. Uh, you still have the time, so that's all we're going to focus on at the moment. Yes. <laughs> All right. So, obviously, um, another one of the, 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 the questions. Sorry, let's just, uh, with regards to the question we were busy with was uh, about, um, you know, being a professional woman, you know, what, what advice you would give to the, to the, to, who, 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 talking about when, uh, Yes, I think, um, like I've mentioned, for me, I, I was fortunate enough, fortunate enough that, that things worked out the way that I, I can still, at, at the age that I'm at, continue um, on a professional level being an athlete. Um, I think, yeah, the, the short advice that I can give, if you find joy in something, um, whether it comes with challenges, it will always, anything will come, come with challenges, but Continue as long as you can, um, if it still brings you joy. There's always a way to find support and, and how you can do it and people that, that can support you. If you, um, yeah, I think if, if, if the joy and the passion is strong enough, then, then there's always a way. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, that, that, that's, I think we, we, we've touched on that a, a, quite a few times about the motivation and just finding your why. You know, that's, if, if there's one thing that people must remember is uh, find your why. That's what Wenda has been advising the whole time. Because once you've got your why, what book have you been reading, Wenda? It sounds like you've been reading a, a motivational book that has been talking about. Um, I'd like to read that keeps you motivated as well. Just repeat, sorry, you, you froze. Just repeat that question. Hello? Yes. So you're talking about the, the, the... sorry? Just... I'm saying you're speaking about your why a lot. Can you hear me now? Yes. Yeah, so it sounds like you're reading something that's reminding you the whole time. Find your why, your reason, why. 
is it something that you're reading or is this just something that you just learned recently uh, over the years <laughs> oh I, i think i i do read but it's not a specific book like find your why or <laughs> um i think i'm very fond of quotes so um it's also something where i i get my energy or my um motivation from so i will scroll the social media and just get some extra energy from quotes and just get that motivation for the day again um uh, read some scripture that's also why, where i definitely find my my motivation and my why i think over the years it's just something that that stuck to, stuck with me and especially now when i'm a bit older when you look back <laughs> it's like, i mean it, it's something that i would have um, uh, many people have this this question of what will you ask your 15 year old self or 10 yeah. years that's that's the one thing if i knew what i know if i knew then what i know now i will just hammer like find your why find your why why you are, why are you doing this why are you doing this so that's <laughs> yeah. that i will that i will also want to kind of sh- uh, give up on for the youth as well All right, that's that's amazing. Uh, I see Alyssa Conley is also joined in here, the AC the speedster. Uh, she's also joining in to hear what you're talking about. Uh, tell us when the any who, do you have any role models, any athletes that you look up to that um, have motivated you over the years to like uh, to run? Like, who's your role model? Like, who do you like? That that athlete is the one that um, motivated you to run. Brayton Pool, we see you as well. Uh, shout out for joining, guys. Thanks. that is um i have a very open answer to that uh, i don't really have one specific person i have like i've mentioned before we we have so many different uh, um types of people in our lives we yeah. we can get that motivation from or inspiration from and these different characters or different things that people do um on a daily basis it can be today i find inspiration from you team by with something i saw that you did or how you kind of reacted to someone or the kindness yeah. you showed tomorrow this another person that i that i find, draw some inspiration from um in the in the athletics world i've also learned that it's so easy especially on the social media with these <laughs> famous heroes in our sport um that's always kind of in the limelight and we just see all these these things about other people find everything I think we do we believe we do because we see them every day yeah. as well yeah, we see them on the track at the world cup olympics but as a person i can't just judge them or yeah with with just what i see um so obviously yeah there's not just one person that i look up to so i I take all of these different characters that 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 they portray to us through the world the things that we can see and then I will kind of fit that into I I want to strive to be like that or um today that person motivated me in what they said or how they yeah, yeah. Re- reacted to big situation so yeah that's definitely um in in kind of in summary what what I would say but there's always always athletes that that I will look up to um and local athletes uh, uh, um international athletes so yeah there's something we can learn from everyone okay cool this is going to be my last question to you uh if anybody else wants to drop something but i think also we're going to wrap it up now uh, with all those interferences it ended up being a bit longer um apologies about that Yeah, I don't know. It's, I think it's it's probably my side. I don't know why. Like it's been fine all other days. Oh, maybe it's your side. You know what I mean? Let's share let's share 50/50. Let's say 50/50. <laughs> <laughs> we share the blame. All right. Yes. Um any athletes that you, you in South Africa, I'm just going to put you on the block like maybe what, what is, are the athletes that you've seen in South Africa that you've looked at and be like, "Wow. Um this is somebody that Obviously there's a lot is a long way from being a good uh, youth or junior athlete to become like an exceptional senior um but is there anybody that you've looked at and at or somebody that you you've seen 
and admire for, for, for what they've achieved at such a young age? Is there any athlete in South Africa that you can identify like that? I'm not sure if I understand the question correctly. So is, is, there, it, is you want to look at the youth and junior athletes, you, which athlete has stood out to you and be like, wow, this person is something special. Uh, I'm going to look out for them. It doesn't mean anything. It's just like I'm looking out for them. Well, if I must immediately th think of something. <laughs> um, if, I, if I look at her career as a youth and junior athlete, um, that is really exceptional. And just the the fight and drive she, she portrays um, on the track. Um, yeah, I, I think when I think about her, I, I do believe she's got a very bright career ahead of her. Um, as a senior athlete, she's, she's done so well as a junior and a youth athlete. Um, yeah, and, and because it's, it's in my event as well, I, I support it extra special. <laughs> um, yeah, and I think in a way, if I look back at some, some videos and, and things I've seen from, of Myrtle, um, she kind of reminds me of her. Um, so I think, yeah, I'm, I'm actually excited for, to, to see in the next 10 years what, what her career will look like. But then again, there's a lot of other athletes. But yeah, of course. Just, from the from my head, I'm I'm just thinking about her. Can you just repeat the name? I think my phone froze when you said it. Oh, um, Zene. Okay, Zene, Zene van der Waal. Okay, cool. Thanks a lot. Um, yeah. So we're gonna wrap it up now. Uh, is there anything that you wanna say to everybody who is um watching and has been supporting you? I I still think you've got. Uh, easily like another four years in your in your body the way you take care of yourself and you know you're so disciplined and always so focused whether you want it or not i don't know but i think you still got like four years i mean your six pack is and 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 your your, your physique and your mind and everything it just shows that you know you, you you're a professional athlete and it's, it's always nice to see uh the way you live your life the discipline the focus how you know, you take it uh, by stride, you know. So, you've got four years in you. Um, so, just, yeah, what do you want to tell to people that uh, support you and those that believe in you and, uh, uh, you know, what do you want to tell them? Yeah, it's actually um, people like you that, that makes me want to continue. <laughs> that I, I really do appreciate all the support. And, yeah, I think... One should never underestimate the, the difference of just being friendly or kind or just sharing a smile to your fellow athletes and or just giving them a, a word of encouragement, even if you think it's something simple um, or they, they are so tired, they're not even going to hear you. Say it, share it. Um, yeah. so you, you never know just that one phrase, how big of a difference that can make in someone's career or whether they decide to continue with something or not. So, um, yeah, don't, don't um, hesitate on, on sharing the, the good stuff. <laughs> sharing the love. Exactly. Yes, sharing the love. <laughs> All right, thanks. I mean, um, yeah, I think from my side, you know, really appreciate your time. Uh, thanks for coming on. Thanks for sharing. Uh, there's so much, you know, I think there's so much knowledge that uh, the, 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 the athletes you guys have, you senior athletes especially, that um, can be passed on, you know, to the young athletes. Um, and <laughs> I see uh, Saudi says, oh. uh, never seen wind on the ground from lactic. I don't know if that's a joke. <laughs> but I've, I've, I've seen you hurt a few times at training. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Pain. <laughs> <laughs> but thanks, Wenda. Um, thanks for always inspiring and thanks for, 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 for sticking with it. You know what I mean? You made a commitment and I mean, you've got eight uh, senior titles. I mean, that's crazy. I mean, Commonwealth. Next year, Olympic Games, you know, are coming up. And who knows what the future has for you as well. So, yeah, keep at it. Keep pushing. Uh, keep spreading the love and your smile and continue, like, inspiring all these uh, young athletes. You know, really appreciate it. Thank you so much. I just want to thank you as well for all the time you guys <laughs> are putting in. Creating this plan. Amazing what, what you are doing and and thank you. Thank you for, for all your time and support. Yeah, backtrack, you know, we're making sure that we're being tracked back. Uh, and that, that's the most important thing. Uh, I think that's the most important thing, you know. People must see you guys shine 
and uh, yeah that's what we we trying to do uh, tian smith i see you a uh, big up to you buddy um and yeah everybody thanks for tuning in thanks for watching back chat uh with our superstar wenda now uh, we're going to close it here sorry for all the interruptions that we had today it was not as smooth because of internet and wifi connections but yeah this thing is happening this is south africa after all uh, and uh, wifi is not as powerful as <laughs> everywhere else in the world uh, thanks wenda uh, we we'll, we'll catch up soon we're going to do that cooking show at your place we're going to yes. make the the folks and knives do their things and we're going to chow perfect we'll do All that right, take care thanks <laughs> okay bye bye uh -oh.